welcome this is the energy vibration reading for whole sun moon and rising capricorns i want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back this has been a wonderful journey happy new year to all the capricorns out there um please remember to listen to your sun moon and rising sign this is the first week of this year 2000 and 17 and the energy vibration of this week is going to be the energy of the eye princess along with your own energy vibration and along with that you Capricorns have gotten the Sun the Sun was the energy of the month of January and you got the Sun again for the first week of January 2017 okay you Capricorns uh, I have said it thousands of time that this year the year 2017 is going to be a fantastic year for you guys and this is how the Universal Angels are showing you that it is going to be the energy of the eye princess you guys are so intuition this is good to start this week off as a water energy you guys work with the eye princess you guys work with the energies of uh, the eye princess you work with your intuition and this is good your energy vibration is here and your energy vibration as the energy of the Empress is here supporting you this mean that whatsoever your intuition is going to go to an higher level it's going to speak out and your financial abundance and prosperity is going to flow it's going to be a yield and flow because the Sun energy is bringing you things beyond your wildest imagination and dreams good things are coming in for you because um, Capricorns so this energy of the Sun is your focus for this week of uh, um, the first week of January 2017 congratulations I am happy I am so joyous that I could give you this reading I want to say to each and everyone out there know that love is the only thing that's real forget the past and look for a better future because there is going to be a better future for you Capricorns whatever has transpired in the year 2016 let it go let it go you don't need that for um, energy anymore in your life it's a year of transformation huge transformation all you Capricorns that has been blocked their ways are going to be cleared for you guys I'm loving this okay as I look at your week the green the energy of green and yellow is here green and yellow is here and blue um, it's like an aqua this is more a week for the indigos Capricorn as I break down your week and I look at your numbers in this week the eight the sign of infinity you have three eights lining up with each other three eights whenever we see the energies of three eights lining up together the universe is telling you and letting you know that financial abundance is going to come to you on the wings of the angels okay so this is wonderful um, the eights are here three eights are here for you guys so this is a powerful week as we begin the week and I'm looking at your energies your best day um, there is absolutely not one of those days that you would say except from Tuesday justice you have justice you have gotten justice and the, the best day for you guys is Wednesday because you have the Ace of Pentacles and the Ace of Pentacles, all the aces are new beginning. So this week for you, you Capricorns is going to be a week of new beginning. On Wednesday, you are going to see this new beginning being awakened and aware because the Ace of Pentacles is between the energy of justice and the devil. 
the energy of the month is the energy of justice so that is a general energy for the month what is happening here is that um, and, and this is such a strange and uh, strange layer um, energy that you got because you begin the week with the eight of ones the eight of ones is that um, a lot of information will be coming into you you know information will be coming in quick in a quick 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 aspect quick um, sort of a, a way to you and these um, this energy of the eight of ones with these uh, you know it's like information coming to you from all over and it has something to do with justice something that was unjust to you is being now justified and you are going to have a lot of these energies coming into you a lot of uh, information and these are good information coming into you on Tuesday you have the energy of justice so if you were having a situation a lawsuit or whatsoever you're going to be the winner of this lawsuit justice is here the Sun is here that means and um, that means that you're going to win the lawsuit so whatsoever was happening if you had a this um, something dishonesty unjust was done to you you are going to win this and win this big time so whosoever had done you injustice the universe has stepped in and is going to make this um, a, a rememberable thing for you but also you are going to learn a lesson and you're going to walk away from this on Wednesday in the middle of the week you have the energy of the haze of Pentacles congratulations guys um, you're another earth element this is your best day whatever you're thinking about doing Wednesday is going to be the best day for you to um, do whatever you are planning on doing Wednesday the energy vibration is the earth element which is absolutely good and um, fit expect good health and financial abundancy whatever if you're trying to apply for a job and interview set it on Wednesday because it's gonna happen for you as we look forward and we see the energies on Thursday we have the energy of the devil and it's okay because what it was happening is that the devil energy is a fire energy okay the devil carry the energy of fire and the devil energy is um, when it's not this in this sense is that you have been dealing with a lot of negative energy people a lot of negative situation a lot of negative places in the last couple of years and this energy is now being lifted this devil has no more bondage over you you have released yourself from the ends of uh, this negative situation this situation you have learned a lesson and you're moving away and I love the energy of this card because it shows this negative force in a different light which is so good as we look at Friday we have another um, seven of ones and on Friday you'll be protecting yourself from negative forces that is coming at you and you know this is perfect this is this layout and what is happening is that you have won a lawsuit you have been unjustly um, accused or something unjustly has done to you and the universe has stepped in and said no more the universe said here must and balance come in this situation that has been happening whatever that was blocking you whoever these um, entity or people or situation or energy was um, it's you know you're protecting yourself from it on Friday you know this is a week which shows the energy of uh, certain aspects certain things things that has been blocking you on, on on Saturday 
we have the energy of uh, the eight of swords not seeing something clearly so on saturday the, that unseen not seeing something clearly comes back another sign got this but it can happen and yet still it is bringing you wonderful blessings because it made up the the third eight so whatsoever is happening don't look at this energy I've not seen clearly actually things are clearer than ever but you need to look at it from an eye perspective because justice comes in but you're not seeing something clearly on Sunday we have the energy of uh, the the conniver of ones the conniver of ones is like the page of ones um, bringing you a message and the clave of one message messages I love this energy and this is good because the message will be coming from how you know the universal angels or your guides because it's the energy of uh, the um, I princess so the I princess is going to send you a lot of any um, information this information going uh, is going to let you know be careful some people should be careful about the information that is coming in because it, the devil could be sending this information so be aware that negative energies can send you information and negative energies are here in this week so you know be aware and this energy is sitting between the canal from ones is sitting between um, you know you not are in your head and not having clarity over a situation and that has to do with you protecting yourself which it's perfectly okay and it's perfectly good what you're doing because you need to really protect yourself from whatever has been going on around you this is extremely good for you Capricorns to understand okay as I look at the week and I'm going to look at it in the love section first as I look at the week in the love section especially for the women um, if you were divorcing your divorce settlement is going to come through it's going to be good um, and then you're going to be brought back to a good balance a good hell um, balance because justice is here you know information is going to come to you justice as prevail you're not seeing the situation clearly but justice as pre uh, prevail as we're going to look at this week and break down this week whenever it comes to love okay um, as we look on Monday we have information coming to you on Monday on Tuesday you have the energy of justice okay so on Monday you have the eight of um, ones and um, this has to do with a situation that is going on around you this situation has to do with something that has to do with um, people who are divorcing the energy vibration on Monday and Tuesday have to do with the people who are divorcing and what is happening to you guys is that um, the divorce is going to be um, finalized and um, you're going to get a lot of information coming to you but this information is not going to be very clear okay so whatever is going on with the justice system legal situation that sort of a thing information are going to be coming to you on Monday but this is not going to clear so for the people who are divorcing um, and releasing each other out of karmatic situation and relationship it's not going to be good on Monday and Tuesday because uh, with a lot of information coming over the situation there's no clarity as to what is going on clarity is the energy of the eight 
as we look at these three um, cards together, they're all three eights, which is saying to a lot of people who are divorcing that your financial abundancy is going to be extremely good. This is the energy of three eights. So the eight, eights, three eights. Whenever the energy of three eights comes up, uh, for you female Capricorns out there, male, male Capricorns who are having business situation and so Monday and Tuesday, if you had an unjust um, system, uh, injustice against you, um, that has to do with financial abundancy. Um, you're going to get information about this. The information won't be clear, but these three cards are saying that whatever is happened, the financial abundancy, the number eight energies are going to be so prominent for you and it's going to balance whatever that had gone and whatever was this honestly had gone against you. As we look forward, we are having looking at the honor energies as love for you, Capricorns. We have the energy of the devil. Okay, energy of the devil have a situation with the seven. You are protecting yourself from this claver. This claver is an energy vibration that you're protecting yourself from. So it's like the page of wands that has a situation with the devil. Okay. And I want you guys to look at this relationships for you Capricorn in this year 2017 is only good on at the, at the end of the year okay um, for the rest of the year and in the middle of the year the relationships for you guys are not going to be balanced it's going to be unbalanced rocky 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 road okay I've always said rocky rocky road for you guys in relationship in the month in the year 2017 okay what's happening is that we need to understand that this devil energy this energy of the devil it is an energy vibration of someone that you are dealing with in a relationship that is not vibrating on a good energy vibration and somebody is going to bring in message and this is a fire sign person these two energies are fire sign that you have to work with and these two persons you're protecting yourself from so the energy of the devil is the energy of something that you are bondage to something that is trying to break your stride it's trying to clear um, um, lower energies negativity around you okay and so it says this energy of the devil is an energy from um, people situations that are trying to create clear karmatic situation and you're going to get a message from this and you're protecting it's like these two energy is uh, the energy of two fire people for some people who have a relationship or have a children who is of an a fire sign which is a Leo uh, Sagittarius or a, um, a Aries person you it's, it's, it's as if this child is not vibrating this child could be um, on the um, the use of drugs or negativity that is um, that, that, that this child is using and you're protecting yourself yeah. from this child and this situation it could be for a young adult that um, this the situation with this young child is so it says that either the person is having an effect of uh, the influence from um, stuff in their system 
this is not good this is not a good relationship this person this fire sign person um, it, who is coming in your life or is uh, in your life is not good it's not good it's it's just not good not good protect yourself from this energy okay it is a young young it's it's not yet 35 and um, be careful of this person because this person um, it can be a family member it can be someone who you know who you love but protect yourself in this time you need to protect yourself from these energies around you as we look at business um, with the energy of the devil and this some people will have a situation that you will have a situation with uh, the message from this page is a messenger be aware of this person be you know if uh, um, someone um, if you're having a business and someone connect to you or connect to you about specific situation in your life be aware that you need to focus and be aware that this person is carrying news or is not vibrating at a good idea this person is um, negative uh, negative against it's bringing it's bringing in car, um, karmatic situation against you and this is not good okay so be aware of this person be aware of this person energy for this person is it good but as we look at the weekend and this person um, you're having a little confusion with this um, Clive of, of, of ones I am NOT liking this energy I'm getting a very negative energy it's so it is this person is creating um, um, chaotic situations for you this person is really creating chaotic situations for you be aware of this person who is coming in it's normally this the 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 carb the carb of a sword good night good night and um, this is creating some sort of a situation that is not healthy for you be aware how you deal with this person in the weekend because this this person you know the eight the eight of sword is always with the cover is always somebody who is creating karmatic <clears throat> um, negative energies karmatic things so be aware of what's going on for the rest financial abundance the universe have showed you financial abundance is is as if um, for you Capricorns um, the the universe is showing you that your financial abundance in the year 2017 is going to be so powerful you uh, uh, it's, it's, it's as if financial abundance is going to come to you on the wings of the dove um, you, you, your your middle thing with the Sun is the ace of Pentacles so whatever financial situation you have been dealing with for a couple of years that is now going to um, come in balance and from this your financial flow is in balance then everything is going to automatically flow in your life so for all the people out there that was having financial abundance and so if your business was um, having a rocky start and that sort of a thing it's going to be better it's going to be wonderful it's going to be so vibrating it's going to vibrate at such a high level that it's just going to be wonderful so for business for you Capricorns it's just going to be a time when wonderful new energies are going to come in the universe is going to full of surprises for you guys and this is going to be good I'm wishing you a wonderful week and we'll talk next week.